of uh, yeah, my gnarliest catapults ever. <laughs> I feel amazing! Woo! Yes! Yes! Welcome to a new video. In the last video, you saw me getting uh, punished in the competition. <laughs> Hopefully, that goes better uh, in this one. We're just uh, having our breakfast in the Team Starboard house. And now I'm gonna finish my shake and then we're off to the beach and hopefully we get some sailing today and tomorrow. Good Morgen. He's representing Sola. Rico. Maybe you know what's happening in my sail. I, I want to pull the mast in. It gets stuck before the... Yeah, I know. Where is the sail? Yesterday I had the same problem and I forced it in. And... Now connect it and go in. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, now wait. Now we are here. Yeah. I, we just missed the cat to go back once here. Okay, go in. Let's see. Oh, amazing! Thanks, man. But you know what happened? Just so you, know. you tell the sail maker to open it here yeah. and rip this, and you open the other pocket. So the mask goes in other pocket. The guy on the machine needs to just close you this pocket. It's a seven minutes job. You know, yeah. you need to open from here to here and just sew this, and that's it's it. Quite easy. Yeah. The guy knows the sails. Rico develops those sails together with the sail maker, so. He knows every little part of it. Guys, this was probably one of uh, yeah, my gnarliest catapults ever. I'm not sure if I hit something or not. I don't want to keep saying like I hit something, but I felt very much in control and it was quite a good start. But the boom broke in three different places. And then the mass broke too. The sail ripped. So yeah, that was a pretty gnarly one. Oh, I'm not sure if I injured myself too, but what a shame. I had a really good start, was very much in control, and then just that catapult out of nowhere. Fucking hell. My bait foil. Good effort. Catapult. How many catapults did you do this week? Jesus! It's the third one. How many three races we did? Four. Four races, three catapults. Okay, I'm one behind. I heard it, it was the scariest shit ever. I knew it was a new pride. And, and I look up and I'm like, oh no, the guys are about to roll me. I'm like, okay, they don't roll me, I guess. Whoa, it looked very nasty. Did you break something? Did I break something? Look here, man. <laughs> look around you, man. Look around. <laughs> <laughs> help me, help me. Oh! <laughs> it still held up. From that guy, the nose of the board must be gone. The board is fine. Yeah, but you said everything <laughs> else broke. You went out of the water? No, I didn't. Either it's like either the, the wing lost traction or there was something. But I was going fine. I was not too high. I bait now.
a bit better. I forgot my action cam, in case you were wondering if you couldn't see anything. But I now I feel like I, I don't quite have the speed to be in the top top. This event is very interesting because you can use any equipment. It doesn't have to be registered equipment. All the riders get out the latest prototypes they have. Now um, I was on the production gear. It's interesting to see how the difference is to the other. Didn't quite have the speed. The result was better than before. But the interesting thing is because the course is so long, no matter if you start bad or not, you kind of end up in the, in the same place. It was mo more steady out there now and I felt like I was racing a bit at least today. Which place did you get? Too many people to count. We have to check from the scorecard. And now I got something really, really special for you guys. Probably smallest slalom board I've ever used. I've got to prepare that one because tomorrow it's supposed to be the windiest day, something like 30 plus knot. And I got this board just for this event. I want to do well when it's windy. I wanted to do well the whole event, but now I realize this is going to be my, my chance. So I'm going to prepare the Isonic 55. Oh yeah. What a machine. 55 centimeter wide. Don't ever use that small boards. Oh. To enter the Defi Win Isonic 55 giveaway, you just need to leave a comment under this or my last Defi Win video and subscribe to the channel. Also, head over to the giveaway on my Instagram profile to increase your chances to win. The winner will be announced on 5th of December. Good luck to everyone. Today is supposed to be the windiest day of the event. So, finally, bringing down the small board. Let's see if it actually materializes. We shall see. What do you think? It's not, it's not so windy yet, is it? No, it's like 55 minutes from now. Yeah. I feel like every day is getting colder. Today is absolutely freezing. Uh, I rigged the 5.8 now, small board. Might get the 5.2 ready as well. 6.6, six, not really an option. That's what I crashed yesterday and I don't have a spare one. Got the Isonic 63 here and a 32 centimeter shopper fin. I tell you, we start going please, on the please, field. I was like, nobody pass. What is this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We take a, you take a start with me. I was like, Enrico, go away. I don't want you here. <laughs> then everybody point there to point to all these fing foilers. I say, you go up. I go straight. I cut the bull 400 meters before Mark. I could not believe it. And I hurt my legs so much in the. Uh. Okay. I, I don't know. I was like, okay, now I relax, so I do a good jive. <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't know what I was doing. Relax, relax is not relax. good. You know, I just try to relax hands a bit to get some blood in. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, it's okay. Yeah. I'm slowly getting better. I did it 25th now. <laughs> before 30, before 33, but uh, now properly windy. 5.8, small board. Still not on the Isonic 55, which you can win, by the way. All the infos are down below in the description, but yeah. So this is gonna be the last race of the event and I'm already, I'm, I'm pretty tired by now. I have to motivate myself to go out for the last one. I think it's gonna be 6-3 again and uh, then pack everything up and go. The energy is down a bit. Matteo, what do you rig? 5-5? Five, five? So 
so thirsty. God, oh, you look so fucking fit right now. Wow, okay. I feel amazing. This is the last race of the event, and I might actually be able to use that iSonic 55 that one of you guys can win. All you have to do is to leave a comment under the video, subscribe to this channel. If you want to increase your chances, head over to the Instagram giveaway too. All the infos are in the description. Woo, what a beauty. One of you is gonna win this baby and I'm gonna take it out now for the last race. Oof, made it. That's it, definitely went, it's over. It's so exhausting, you have no idea. Man, the further you go out, the heavier the chop gets and the more tired you become. So that's not a good combination. And it's just a fight. So big respect to everyone. Everyone who went out there today. It's all fun and games until you get on the, on the fin. On the foil is kind of okay, but I'm so dead now. But hey, this board, I mean, I don't know if it was the best choice now. Maybe it wasn't windy enough, but it was just so much fun. And like even the jibes, I was very surprised. I thought I was gonna get stuck in the jibes. The board, so fun, man. Yeah? Yeah, sick. On the first reach, I got squeezed upwind, you know? So you missed the podium on zero point something. Fuck. We never really do this, you know, when we train for PWA and this is something different. I personally, I felt like I was missing pace towards the end. In the beginning, I was gaining spots, especially in the jibes, I was gaining places. But on the last reach, I was always losing. And that is it for this video. Thank you so much for tuning in and uh, sticking around all the way to the end. If you are still watching, you're an absolute legend. The Defi Wind uh, has been an amazing experience, really, really tough. We had some of the races with uh, up to 30 kilometers in total distance. I ended up in 27th place. Started off really weak, uh, had some problems with the gear choice and adapting to the races. Uh, to the start but uh, I gradually got a little bit better so uh, yeah I know what to do differently next I hope to come back next year it's actually gonna be in May I, again I think where the wind is a lot better and hopefully is a bit warmer so looking forward to come back like I said it's been an amazing experience you know wh wherever you are on the course you always find someone to battle with yeah that's what it's about it's a lot of fun like I said you're an absolute legend if you're still watching to the end let me know in the comments how you like the video leave it a like as well and if you want to win the ISON 55 2022 also make sure to subscribe to the channel leave a comment below you can also increase your chances by joining on instagram so um yeah all the infos are down in the video description uh, yeah and i would say i see you guys in the next video bye Antoine, Antoine. 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 Antoine.